The one arm push-up is one of the most impressive and challenging calisthenic skills you can learn. It requires a great amount of strength and trains your tricep, back, chest and shoulders. If you're starting to learn the one-arm push-up, make sure you can do at least 30 to 40 push-ups, since this will give you a great foundation. Make sure you also train explosive push-ups, since these increase your pushing strength dramatically. The next exercise you should be doing is assisted one-arm push-ups or fingertip push-ups. These will help you get used to how it feels doing a one-arm push-up. Of course, make sure you train both sides. Next up, we're going to be doing the assisted one-arm push-up. These will help you develop the necessary strength to do the one-arm push-up. The same applies to this exercise, make sure you train both sides since you want to avoid muscle imbalances. Deep push-ups are great because of their increased range of motion, which will overall give you more pushing strength. Make sure to master these before moving on to the next progression. Incline one-arm push-ups are a great exercise to help you build up the strength you need for the one-arm push-up because they're a bit easier. If they get too easy, you can always decrease the height or already try out a full one-arm push-up. The negative one-arm push-up is the last exercise you'll be doing before you'll actually get your first one-arm push-up. Make sure you come down slowly and control the whole movement. Make sure to include all of these exercises into your workout and you'll be doing one arm push-ups in no time. 